What is happening, everybody? Welcome back to Dark Horse Sports Cards. You've got Silver Sage and Brody back here. Welcome back to another video. Sage, fun, exciting new product in basketball. We've been waiting for something new, and we got it. Yeah, this is the first time they've ever released Blaster's retail or retail product of Revolution. And if you guys haven't seen this product ever opened, you're in for a treat. Uh, there's a lot of sparkly cards coming, a lot of refractors, a lot of color. These cards are unlike anything you've ever seen. So I feel like those uh, street performers <laughs> where they do. <laughs> um, all right, yeah, so Revolution, we got four cards per pack, six packs per box. Uh, let's see here. We, we can pull autographs out of here, which, hey, whenever you can pull autographs out of retail, I'm a fan of that. Blaster exclusive is going to be levels and red swirl parallels. So keep an eye out for that. And yeah, this is like it says debut retail. And this is all, all the stuff you can pull. So there are some number cards on here, number to 199, all the way down to 35. Then you've got some Vortex, Rookie Revolution, Shockwave, Lift, lift Off um star factor is there any case i don't think there's any case hits there's nothing like super crazy chase right there's not a there's nothing like a downtown or a kaboom or anything like that in here right not that i'm aware of i hope we pull one and figure out we're wrong though <laughs> but so it looks like the best card in here is probably picking up like a victor number to 30 yes that would be amazing that would be insane. Any victors are great. And the product is fairly new, so it's going to be hard to try to find comps, but I'll do my best. Oh, I know. Because <laughs> I guess they did have Hobby come out, so there might be some, but a lot of the Hobby versions, I think, of this card are not what's in retail. Right. They won't have, like, the red so. swirls numbered to 35 no. or anything like that. But, yeah, how you got this at uh, Target? Uh... Walmart target? Uh, I'm not sure. Something. Are they different? They're already no. I think it's all the same, but they're already going for almost double on eBay and hard to find. Yeah, and uh, wait. So put that back in, and let's just sell it. <laughs> <laughs> we'll actually have some of these guys. Um, I'm not sure when this video will go up, but uh, we'll have some of these on whatnot as well. So if you want to go check over there, uh, we'll rip some of these too. Maybe do a little basketball break, a little windy hunt. That could be kind of fun. We got to go. Next time I'm out in Vegas, me and Sage are going to do a uh, a whatnot stream. Oh, I did notice you got to you gotta open them and then flip them and then pull them out this way. I did see that they're all like kind of. So I think the first card here is the hit. This guy. OG Anubo? An Anubu? <laughs> Yeah. Oh, no, this is just the base. No, this is just the base. That's how shiny the base are. Yeah. Those are just three bases. Holy smokes. Never mind. This was this was the card. Shockwave. Anthony Edwards, Shockwave. All right. Seems good. All right. All right. Seems all right. Okay, so wait. Maybe I – yeah, so you – Let's let's try this. We're going to open it here. Oh, no, we're just going to get straight on it. So I need to flip it. Scoop. Oh, look at this. Supernova? Supernova. And that's going to be levels. So that is the uh, that is the parallel. Yeah. Supernova levels. Okay. That might be a good card. Look it up. And then we got three base cards there. So it seems like each one of these packs has one hit or, or one non-base card. And then the rest are all base. Well, I guess we just see it right off. There's a nice one. LeBron on the Vortex. Oh, and then we get our first rookie. Julian Strother from Denver. DeMar Roseland. There's a nice Luca. All right, the good is about $7. Wow. Look at that. These were $27. Bucks. We are getting close. Yeah. Yeah, that's a nice one to get the uh, the parallel too there. I think there's 24, 24 cards in there. So uh, yeah, it's, like a, it's, it's like a dollar per card. This is an inventory uh, treat. Dream. <laughs> Dream. <laughs> All right, there you go. All right. What is that one? That looks Stars? special. 
What is this? I do like these sets because it tells you Star what it factor? is. This is an Astro. Oh, Astro. Astro. The Astro of Jalen Johnson. Not a rookie. All right. But that's a cool card. Hero, Paul George, and Chris Paul. The base cards are really busy here, Sage. Yes. A lot going on. Yes. Paul George needs his guy, Kawhi, to play this postseason if he wants a chance. And Kawhi's knees swelling up just a little mm -hmm. bit, I hear. But they're turning into my knees. Is this the red swirl? Oh, there's numbers. What? 199. All right. Marcus Sasser, number to 199. That's going to be uh, that's going to be red swirl. Yeah. Yeah. Red swirl, number to 199. Hey, we pulled a number card out of retail. I like that. I always like pulling a number card. It's a pretty nice looking card, too. Goes good with the Pistons, kind of like a color match. Or like an off-color match, I guess you would say, right? Yeah. You like about a 5 $6 card. All right. All right, nice. I'll take it. Damian Lillard, Terry Rozier, and a Trey Young. Let me sleeve up the um, – what was this Vortex LeBron? That might be a couple All bucks. Right. Let me check this one out. You say it was the Supernova was the one? Yeah. Oh, Vortex LeBron. It's always good. It's like six to ten dollars. It's not a um it's not a uh levels though. It's just a base. Correct. You might be looking at the levels one, but maybe not. Maybe it is maybe it is that good. Yeah. It doesn't help that nobody knows what year they they, <laughs> they it is when they list basketball cards. eBay's just a nightmare what, for years. What year are we? Yeah, because it just idea. it's over two different years. Oh, hot scoop box. Oh, all right, scoot. What is this one, Sage? Rookie Revolution. Um, oh, okay, so it's just a rookie revolution insert. All right, nice little scoop box. Kobe Buffkin on the rookie, Colin Sexton, and a Ja Morant. All right, that's gonna be the first box. Honestly, not kind of fun, kind of fun rip. LeBron just took over the game at one point in the last week and uh, dunked. And John Morant comes out, comes out on the court. He's in street clothes and he goes, "Just wait till I suit up. Just wait till I suit." Like, well, like he's gonna block. Yeah, him? it's like such a weird flex. Like, dude, you're on the sidelines. You're not. You're in street clothes. Why are you running on the court? <laughs> Isn't John more like an offensive player than defensive? Yeah, player? he's just talking trash. What do you think of uh, Caitlin Clark going number one? Uh, I saw that a good four-year deal. Uh, the numbers. I, She's not going to what you call it the the whatever league it is. Right, the big three league. The big three league, yeah. Yeah, I get. All right, do you know this cat? To to Mari Kamara? No. I do not know that. Trailblazers? Is it a rookie? It's a rookie on the Astro. Rudy, Devin Booker, and Nikolai Jokic. Yeah, I don't know who that is. He's not in the he's not in the prison set. Yeah. Oh, me and Kelsey just opened up um some oh here we go. There's a nice rookie. Dude, a lot Amar Thompson. All right. Uh, or a, a Min Thompson. Excuse oh. Me. A, on levels. This might be a good card here. Rookie Revolution on levels. A Min Thompson. But I was saying, me and Kelsey just opened up some new product. And uh, what's his name? Is on the Chase Claypool, I believe. Is on the Dolphins now. Okay. And he was on the Bears, I believe. So it was just interesting seeing him in a Dolphins jersey. Oh, they already have it fixed. Nice. They already have it. That looks yeah, like a fifteen twenty dollar card there. The Ricky Revolutions. That's nice. Wow. Yeah. Yes, sir. That is nice. Check our eBay. It might be up on our eBay, <laughs> folks. Link in the description down below. eBay's popping. Sage has been. You got. You've been putting a a ton of baseball. On yes. Baseball's hot right now. It's uh. That looks like LeBron to me. On the shockwave, LeBron. That's just going to be a, a normal LeBron on the shockwave, but that's a cool-looking card, too. Yeah. These cards are busy, but I do like them. But they are busy.
Jalen Wilson, Austin Ooh. Reeves. That's a cool photo of him showing the ice. Ice in the veins with the three. And Julius Randle. Okay. Oh wait, we what still have think? three packs. What is what is the what do the cards feel like? Are they chromy? Are they thick? They're like a thick paper. Okay. I wouldn't say chromy. All right. I would say thick paper. They aren't thin. Fraz. Oh, Malcolm Brogdon on the Astro Revolution. What jersey okay. is that that he's wearing? Uh, is that Bulls? No, Rippers? Portland Trailer? Is that Rippers? Yeah. Rip City. Rip City, okay, yeah. Rip City. Rip City jersey or whatever. Jalen Brown, Bam, and Franz. Franz. All right, two packs left of this box. This is a nice little fun rip. Yeah. A little basketball fun rip. No Wimby, though. Um, that would be That would be the key. Oh, we got a Supernova. Giannis? Yeah. Giannis on the Supernova. Oh, cool looking card. Sabonis behind him. Sabonis flexing. Sabonis was one of my uh, first guys I ever PC'd when I started to get into cards. That's an interesting person to pick. Yeah. I just thought Do you, how much? he was so underrated. Oh. I just loved his game. I love these the basketball players that have assists, rebounds, and uh, low turnovers, high threes, some threes. So, yeah, he's racking up the stats how, in the Sacramento these days. How much do you think um, the picture that's on the card, like their actual photo, how much do you think that matters in the value of the card? Um, I think it matters in, Ooh, Steph, there we go. I think it matters a little bit in the non rookies, like, uh, for Jordan's cards, if he's doing his sick layup or something cool for Jordan cards that are not rookies, I think it matters. But, um, generally speaking, I think the only thing that really bothers me is when it's a vertical card. I don't really like those, but, um, what do you mean the horizontal? Yes. Horizontal ones. card. Yeah. Oh, those gosh. are just UFC saves oh, well, tops UFC. <laughs> And I guess it's because it's fighting. And so there's a lot of times like it's an extended punch or an extended kick and they just want to have the action. <laughs> and it's like 30% of the cards in that I box. I will never collect a horizontal side. card. Oh, just instant trash or what? No, I'll just sell it. Very particular. Yeah. Oh, I just like, I, I'm, I, I was, I grew up in the old school where I tried to get all the binders and I got the spaces and that's just how I grew up. And I like to study the binders and look at them. I still got binders of all my, my very first person I PC'd was Dan Marino and I still got my Dan Marino binders. So I go through and look at them and if it's sideways, it messes you up going through the cards. Yep. <laughs> Keontae Johnson. All right. That's going to be on the Astro. Uh, I thought it was Wimby for a split. Johnson. Second, I saw the Spurs. Giddy, Zach Levine. Where's Wimby hiding yeah, out I, at? Come on. We need something. I just uh, I just got our Pokemon collection from my brother. Oh, nice. And so I was going through that these past couple days. You should have done that live on camera to... and recorded your reaction for seeing we it. We actually so have, uh, we have two Shadowless cards, which are the ones that you want. Yep. Uh, there's a Vortex rookie of Cam Whitmore. That might be all right. I'm looking it up. That might be worth a little bit of a penny right there. That's a nice little Cam Whitmore. Where's the Wimby though? We need a Wimby. We want the Wimby. All right. Michael Porter Jr. Like a four dollar card. Spencer Dinwiddle. That's an interesting last name. Yeah, I guess these and Darius Garland. These Vortexes can come. Uh... Kind of like a shattered glass and numbered to 52, like a cubic. Maybe that's just a hobby. I don't know. I've just seen I think that's Okay, hobby. I've seen him yeah. on eBay. We're uh, – the numbers we're trying to pull yes. is red swirl is to 99 or 199, and then levels is to 35. Okay. If you can pull levels on uh, – The red swirl go to 35 too? Wait, what? This is a level, so this isn't number to 35, though. Hmm. Oh, because it's a vortex. 
So it's a, a, if you get a levels on the base, a levels on the base, yeah. Vortex, all the inserts can't be numbered. So the only numbered cards are their actual base cards. Penny needs to figure out how they do odds on the box here. This is so jammed together with 17 slashes. I'm looking at it right now. I can't even read it. So tough. With the odds? Yeah, it's like there's so many different things. They got all these shockwave slash levels, supernova slash levels, right? It's all – it's hey! – oh! What is it? Shockwave. All right. Shockwave Wimby. We got him. Shockwave Wimby. I was looking at eBay talking nonsense. <laughs> we got him. Nice. That's a sick card. Sasha. Sasha. Katie. Evan Mobley. Wow. Three packs to go, too. It's always nice when you can get them and you still have some packs left. Oh, yeah. You think, is it possible to get them twice? Shockwave Wimby. Got him. I'm looking it up right now. We are anticipating. Good thing. Is that a is that a send in to PSA situation? All right, about it's about a forty dollar card. It's it's wow. going up and down, mate. Ooh, seeing one sold sold for fifty five. So it's 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 got a range here. Ooh, ooh, is that a PSA potential card? I've got another order lined Hold up. Hold it up. Let me look at the corners. I'm the PSA king. Mm, these ones are hard to tell the centering because uh, you need a couple other shock waivers. But um, yeah, it looks fine. It looks pretty crispy. Looks pretty crispy. Looks pretty crispy. Might be going. Might be going into the old PSA grading situation. Which right now, one of our big orders that I have is in assembly. Yeah, I need five cards that? to send to my order. So ship that to me, and I'll add it to mine. Wait, how many? How many do you have I'm right at now? Fifteen cards. You gotta start pulling bangers, brother. <laughs> I'm very picky, but the the PSA sale ends in 15 days, so I need need five cards soon. Oh, 15 days, you said? Yeah, they they had a April sale for those of you guys are watching uh, modern sports cards like 2002 and later, uh, 16.99 per card. So so I need to get this order in this week. Yeah, you you got this sale, but you got it in April. Then they. Or the, you got it in March, and they extended it to April. Okay, so I need I need to get this this, this order in. Then. All right. Yes. I mean, I've got a solid twenty some cards over there. All right. So, all right, we have made it to the final pack, ladies and gentlemen. If you are still with us, thank you so much. Hashtag Tadpole Gang in the comments. We appreciate each and every one of you. We are on the quest and the journey and the road to ten thousand subscribers. That is insane. Thank you to each and every one of you. If you haven't subscribed and you join the content, it's free. Click subscribe. Like the buttons down or click the like button down below as well. And uh, check us out on whatnot. We're going to have Silver Sage on whatnot pretty soon here. Doing some baseball. I'll be in the chat if I'm not on camera. <laughs> All right. We got our base LeBron. It's our first base LeBron. Ooh, that's nice. That's nice. And our last one is going to be, oh, is it? Oh, Brandon Miller. That's how you end it. Supernova Brandon Miller. That's the other guy you want. That's like the number two guy. Yeah. Behind Wimby. He's, I mean, he's very, very far behind Wimby. Very far, but still. But he is number two. It's like a $10 card right there. Guy. Wow. Nice. These boxes, a lot of value in these boxes. Sam. I think we did really good, honestly, because. Uh, oh, did I, you? Okay. I, no. You see some I others? see some others, and it was not pretty. Oh no! And I went. I went to the comment section, and one of the guys said, "Well, that's what you get for buying all the retail off the shelves. You get bad boxes." I was like, "Whoa, relax, dude." <laughs> yeah, I think a lot of people, um, a lot of people, kind of judge a product on the value of the cards they got, right? And it's like, "Oh, I didn't get any valuable cards. This product sucks." And it's like. Well, you did technically get valuable cards. You might have gotten valuable cards, but you just got the wrong person on those valuable cards. Sure. So that's how I like to look at it is 
you know, going back and looking at like these cards are cool. They're very different than Don Rust. They're very different than Prism. So this was like a pretty enjoyable rip. We did get a number card too. So it was always nice to get a number card. No autographs though. That would have been really cool. But yeah. I've also heard that the uh, the checklist for autos in this isn't great. Yeah, I, don't, I didn't get too excited about the autograph because I'd rather have a Wimby number. Yes. yes. Go off that Wimby and Brandon Wimby. Miller one more time. Oh, nice. He looks so skinny yes. in the picture. It's because he's seven five. Yeah, I know. That's true. <laughs> he, it's just he's just an absolute animal. So there it is. Wow. All right, uh, let us know what you guys think of Revolution. I think it was fun. We're gonna have some of those for you guys as well. Potentially throw that into a break, maybe with some uh, prison basketball. That could be a fun break. Doing some prison basketball, some Revolution. But that's gonna do it. Sage, anything for the people? No. Uh, thanks for. Tuning in and uh, keep ripping those packs. Keep ripping the packs.